we draw on one apology. Let's find out and have a look at the nominations for Best Comedy TV Show. Curb your enthusiasm. Kath and Kim. <laughs> the Simpsons. Uh, Jackie is now going to read out the winner for us, ladies and gentlemen. The winner is The Simpsons. The Simpsons. Now, The Simpsons is the longest-running animated series in television history. Creator Matt Grayley is here with the voice of beer-swelling Homer Simpson himself, Dan Castellaneta. Matt Grayley also produces newspaper cartoons seen all over the world. Ladies and gentlemen, it is an honor for me to come over here to England from Los Angeles and say, ladies and gentlemen, Dan Castellaneta is Homer Simpson. for me to say <laughs> honor for me to say that Homer Simpson is drunk <laughs> so I don't know how long I can stand up no. but I just want to say yes ma'am now Homer <laughs> yes. you have something prepared oh right? yes I prepared something <laughs> Uh, it is an honor to be included amongst many British greats in comedy, such as Ricky Jarvis, <laughs> Tracy Saunders, or my favorite, the complete cast of full Monty Python. But you know, this award shows how universal The Simpsons is. It's just a simple story about a really handsome guy <laughs> that everybody thinks is really cool. <laughs> but we were afraid the show wouldn't quite translate over here. Yes, there are many similarities between our cultures. For instance, we have Elvis, you have Cliff Richard. <laughs> you have the Rolling Stones, we have the Beatles. <laughs> We have Madonna, and now you have Madonna. <laughs> but there are some differences, so we thought we would help you understand the show better. Because I know that some of the jokes might go over your little limey head. <laughs> For instance, some of you would say, Would you like a lift in me, lorry? <laughs> Whereas we would say, would you like an elevator in my truck? <laughs> when you would say, uh, are you going to eat that jam, buddy? <laughs> we would say, hey, buddy, give me some of that jam. <laughs> and you would say, the prime minister is giving a speech on the telly. We would say, Bush, change the channel. <laughs> Finally, in the UK, a homosexual is known as a pufter. <laughs> Whereas in the US, a homosexual is a well-known Hollywood movie star whom I won't name because I might get sued. Nice to see you, man. And that is some look at Jack.